good afternoon and welcome back to the Triathlon Devs YouTube channel. Where are we off to Amelia? Wales. Wales, Barry Island. Are you okay? Yeah. How long is this trip taking? Mm. Forever. It's taken us like four hours yeah. so far. The traffic's been absolutely rubbish. Where have we been this morning? Hairdressers. Yes, we both had our battle braids done. Turn around, look at Daddy. Amelia's got her battle braids. You got it? Yeah. Tweez! We've got Jasper with us, haven't we? Where's Jasper? Jasper's sneaking. Jasper! Jasper's all chilled out. Jasper's sat in his little tray. Yeah. We've given in trying to provide things for Jasper to sit in because he just likes sitting in his little tray, doesn't he? So we've put a carrier bag in that and a blanket over it. But yeah, hopefully we're about half an hour away from the campsite. Catch up with you soon. Good morning and welcome to the Triathlon Devs YouTube channel. We are at Barry Island. The sun is out, the weather's lovely. Um, I've dragged Amelia and Mark up at seven o'clock on the first day of the holiday so we can come down and I can have a quick recce of the bike course. I was gonna do it last night, but it took us forever to get here. Mark was a bit fraught from having to drive the van <laughs> down single track lanes for about 10 miles. So I thought he needed a beer more than me reccing it. So I'm gonna go and just do one loop of it now. So we'll get that done and then we can do whatever Amelia wants to do for the rest of the day till I have to come back and uh, register later on. <laughs> okay that is the bike recce done so i've just done one loop of it about four miles uh, and it's really nice actually it's dead flat it's a bit annoying on a saturday morning there's like five roundabouts and four sets of traffic lights so i've just pootled along it amelia has been to the park mm -hmm. he enjoying barry mm -hmm. it's quite nice isn't it mm -hmm. although i have just got back from a bike and realized that i've done similar to what i did the other week when i went out mm -hmm. uh, and my back wheel was sticking on it so i've done it with my back wheel sticking so thankfully we figured that out today and not tomorrow come race day the right then mr mechanic how are you doing mr kerry all right i'm gonna fix make sure my bike's sorted yeah so my wheel's yeah. not quite right there's an annoying metal bit of my brake sticking into my finger yeah i'll do that when i uh, have a beer later on okay <laughs> but yeah we're here so it went the wrong really nice we're not when i did go the wrong way didn't i yeah <laughs> I didn't count how many traffic lights I went out across, so I was just counting roundabouts. So I did turn the wrong way and went down there. It's really nice down here. That's not where I'm swimming, don't panic. We'll show you the beach in a minute. That is Race HQ, not really quite set up and running yet. We've got to come back down to register later on. What we're doing now, we're going down, we're going to the pool at the campsite, Amelia. Yes. Yes. I think we are heading to the pool. Right, just trying to sort out the run route, figure out where I'm going tomorrow. Right, because your sense directions rubbish, you yeah. just already made the wrong <laughs> tip on the bike. Yeah, all right. <laughs> so that red dot is roughly where we are now. Yeah. So your run out is down the side of the, those trees. Yeah. And then around the headland. Yeah. Around the other side. Yeah. And then you come back through almost onto the beach. Yeah. Over there, through where those houses are, yeah, and then back, um, back out there, yeah, come back under that, uh, almost under that bridge, and then you're running then down, down there, and then back again. Okay, and then on the second lap, the finish line is marked. Just there. Woohoo. Hopefully, I won't get lost tomorrow. This is where we come out of the swim, run up the beach. And then, <laughs> it's quite a long run to transition. Got to go straight up like two full flights of stairs. That'll be fun. But then after that, it is downhill through the forest. So yeah, it looks like it's probably about a 400 metre run. So I'm not going to tank it too much on the swim tomorrow, I don't think. We will have a steady swim and then try and make it up on the transition run. We are all registered for tomorrow. 180, that's me. We've got a goodie bag, which Amelia seems to be pilfering through already. Go on then, what's in the goodie bag? I'm not sure I'm going to see much of this goodie bag. Pull it out, what we got? A hat. Ooh. Oh, a bobble hat, wicked. Oh, can a Red Bull. Oh. Red Bull gives you wings. Is that energy, electrolytes. High five. High five. Yeah. Some more food. 
Your mate? Mm -hmm. Oh, gel. The gel. Awesome. Is that everything? Yeah. And a cool little bag. What does it say on the bag? Anything? Oh. S W Y D. Do you know what that stands for? No. Sleep when you're dead. <laughs> right. That is that's the registration done then. That's all we need to do today. It's not racking. Out on the run course, found a cheeky little hill. Meant to be flat this course. A little cheeky hill, gonna have to go up that twice. How scandalous. It's lovely here, isn't it? Amelia's volunteered to test the water temperature for me, haven't you? Okay, yeah. you're gonna go get in. Is it warm? Warm. Kind of warm. Isn't this bit? Yeah. Probably as it gets deeper, it will get <laughs> yeah. colder. That's not too bad. Yeah, I mean, that's not too bad. She says I've only got my feet in it. It's proper sludgy as well. Sludgy as well. Well, I'll try not to. <laughs> I mean, generally, I don't want to swallow seawater anyway. Okay, we're going to brave it and see what it's like. Oh dear. It kind of starts off not too bad. And then it feels. Oh man, that... <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Oh, it lures you into this false sense of security that it's warm in that first couple of inches. <laughs> And it's Baltic. Oh. oh my god. Oh, I don't want to do this. Don't want to do this. Is it too late to pull out? Yeah. <laughs> I've changed my mind. I don't want to do this race tomorrow. This water is cold. I think we're all ready. It is Saturday tea time. Sous chefs, hard at work, prepping tea. You right, babes? Yeah, chef, not a sous chef. Sorry, <laughs> chef, yeah, I'm a sous chef. Is my bike ready? It will be after tea, yeah. Awesome, that's what we like. I think I've got everything I want. Uh, that's the stuff I'm going to put on. I'm going for my short sleeve tri suit. I've got my t-shirt to just chuck over the top for in the morning. It's going to be a bit cool in the morning. I think it's going to be about 12, 13 degrees. So I've just got my hat to put on. Um, I am also contemplating putting my calf guards and my arm warmers on for the swim, but we'll see. Hopefully I won't need to do that. Uh, but yeah, I've got everything else. Got my wetsuit, got my hat. I might double hat tomorrow. Got my lube, got my anti-fog, got my chip. Uh, yeah, got everything. Got my shoes, got my helmet, got my trainers, got my gels, got my race number, 180, uh, and all my other little bits and bobs that we need. I think we are ready to rock and roll. Yeah, so we've dipped our feet in the sea, uh, and it's freezing. Uh, have you warmed up yet, Amelia? Amelia's had to come home and have a hot shower, haven't you, because you braved it in the sea, uh, and I didn't. So, yeah. How was the sea? Good. Was it cold? No. No? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so tea time, um, and then I think it's probably going to be a 5 a.m. go up tomorrow. Probably leave about half five, which will get us down to the actual race for six o'clock, uh, which then gives us 40 minutes uh, just to sort of get ready and get down to the seafront for the race briefing at 6.40. Right then, we'll see you in the morning, bright and early.